to the last drop. So this is how much I have left. And um, swirl it around a little bit and just sip. So I have my nice little metal straw here and we'll take the first sip. Ooh, this is also like liquid candy. Hi you guys, welcome back to The Blaze Estate. My name is Erica Ricky Blaze and this week we will be trying out infused lemonade. So I have this cherry lemonade here from Lit Edibles. I kinda had this for a while now. And I have the blue lemonade from Red Lou. Remember, Red Lou is the same person who um, did the infused shrimp Alfredo a couple episodes back. So in order to be fair, I'm gonna have lit edibles on one day and then tomorrow I'm going to try out the blue lemonade from Red Lou. I just wanna be fair and it'll be weird if I try both of them on the same day because I'm not gonna know which did what. So follow me and um, let's get lit on the roof deck. Come on. Where am I gonna sit? All right, you guys, we are here on the roof deck. It's a nice, beautiful, sunny day in the city of Boston. I have my lit edibles right here, so I'm gonna pour them in this cup. Down to the last drop. So this is how much I have left. And um, swirl it around a little bit and just sip. Ooh, it's very tasty. It tastes like liquid candy. I haven't had this in a while, and I am officially out. Well, that was quick. So I'm gonna give this like an hour or so to marinate and then I will be back with a full report. All right, you guys, we are back with our Lit Edibles Cherry Lemonade right here. And um, this bad boy, this bad boy did some damage. So I definitely had to retire to my quarters after that. And honestly, I was wavy for like the rest of the afternoon, like, I'm so sorry that I finished this bottle, which means I need another one soon. But nah, um, they definitely did their job with this one. And I have the cherry lemonade, but I know they have different flavors and I would like to try the different flavors um, eventually. But shout out to Lit Edibles for keeping us hydrated in this hot, humid weather that we have going on in the Boston area. But yeah, Lit Edibles, check them out. Now tomorrow, tomorrow we have Blue Raspberry Lemonade coming up from Red Lou. Hi you guys, welcome back to The Blaze Estate. My name is Erica Ricky Blaze and it is the next day. So as promised, I have Red Lou, where was it? I have Red Lou's Blue Lemonade that we're gonna try today and we're gonna go upstairs and try it out. So let's go to the roof deck again. Right, so let's get started. Hey you guys, we're back on the roof deck and I have my Red Lou Blue Lemonade right here and I'm going to pour it in my little glass. Hmm. Is this good? I think this is good because I only have this much left and I don't want to drink the rest of my drink for this episode. I kind of want to save it a little bit later. And first of all, I want to apologize for my vulgarity and lack of decorum yesterday. I didn't have a straw, so I have my nice little metal straw here, and we'll take the first sip. Ooh, this is also like liquid candy. Should I stir it around a little bit? <laughs> so yeah, we'll let that marinate. You guys, I'm greedy. I'm just gonna take like a little baby bit more. Fuck yeah, I'm just finishing it. Red Lou, you got me. It's done, the whole thing's done. Whatever, just gonna have to get some more. Ooh, this window. All right, you guys, now that I've pumped my stomach with Red Lou's Blue Lemonade, I'm gonna chill for a little bit, let this marinate for about an hour or so, and then I will be back with my findings. All right, you guys, we are back on the Blaze Estate, and Red Lou, Red Lou, Red Lou, Red Lou. That Blue Lemonade has me feeling kinda happy, and I'm just happy to be here. <laughs> Oh my God, I just wanna say that I am 100% absolutely feeling it. And I'm just like super groovy right now. I'm super chill. It's been about an hour and a half since I drank basically the rest of the blue lemonade, which was really good by the way. 
and yeah I'm, I'm just wavy so for six dollars oh my god this is actually kind of a steal oh i'm so sorry i live in the city let me um let me close my window i'm back i'm so sorry about that i'm living in the city i ambulances just come up and down the street all the time but yeah um for six dollars this is actually a legitimate steal oh my gosh just infused lemonade um, but I'm definitely feeling it. He did a great job, you know, making it, flavoring it, whatever. I was looking online. I was trying to see, so how do you make, um, how do you make infused lemonade? And I was looking, I think, from what I've researched, there's two ways to make it. So you can either put, I guess, C uh, not CBD, THC oil in like a lemonade mix and mix it that way. But I don't know how well that works because, you know, oil and water don't mix. But then the second way to do it is like to have, to create some type of THC simple syrup, which more likely is what the guys are using. So you create this THC simple syrup, um, I don't know, I guess you get the weed and you kind of like strain it, you like finally, you have to like get the weed, you have to like finally chop it up or whatever, and then you strain it in some type of thing, and it comes out, I don't know, there's, you can look it up online, but there's a way to make like THC simple syrup, and then when you make your little regular lemonade, you just kind of put it in there, because both lemonades, the Red Lou Blue Lemonade and the Lit Edibles um, Cherry Lemonade, they both, they don't taste the same, but they both have that like liquid candy taste, so I don't know. I never asked them, so I don't know how they make it, but I know there's a general kind of rules of engagement in making it, but um, no, they both were good. I was waiting so long to do this episode. On my show, I've always been featuring like little edibles and things like that, like the chocolate, the um, brownies, candy, uh, what do you call them? What do you call them? Rice Krispies, yes. <laughs> Um, yeah, I've featured like all of those things and then um, I did do another episode with Red Lou and the infused shrimp Alfredo So food I've definitely done but I've never done drinks before so once I got my hand on one of the lemonades I'm Like okay, I want another one to compare it against so I can fully do this episode But yeah, I'm very pleased with the guys. I'm very pleased with both lemonades. They come highly recommended lit edibles Red Lou you guys definitely check them out. Um, I'm gonna tag them in the post and right now, today, you can get your hands on infused lemonade, which is very tasty, very appropriate for the summer season that we're having right now. So I would say hop on that, take a sippy sip. If you don't want um, to eat your calories, you can always drink them. But yeah, highly recommended. So go ahead and do your thing. Thank you guys so much for watching The Blaze Estate, and I will see you on the next one.